Sweet pastry recipe. These are the ingredients you'd need. So first in a bowl, add your softened butter, flour, a teaspoon of baking powder and your salt. Gently start to mix those together with the back of a fork. Just push it and fork it all through until it's all mixed together. And then when it's pretty much all mixed, you then want to, uh, what they call, rub it through. So to do that, you get your two hands, pick up the, the crumbs, and then rub your thumb across your fingers to mix it all together. So pick them up and rub it just like that. That will just make the mixture all fine until it looks like breadcrumbs lovely and fine. So then you get your warmed milk, not too hot, just lightly warm. Add that to your mixture. And fork that through to bring a dough together. I'm going to use my fast forward speed now. If only I could do that in real life, wouldn't it be lovely? Get the ironing done in no time, wouldn't you? So gradually a dough will form. And just give it a, a last little kneading with your hand. And form a ball, like so. And then pop that in the fridge to chill for about 20 minutes and when, when you're ready to use give your surface a dusting and your rolling pin put your pastry onto your surface and you can roll it out to use if you're doing it for a for a flan or a pie I'd recommend about three millimetres thickness and then size it up against the, the baking tin you're using and then gently roll that over your rolling pin ever so gently roll it back until you wind back all the, the pastry that you're going to use and then you can unravel it across your baking tin. It just makes it a lot easier. Like so. Then you're picking up the edges and pushing it into the side of your tin with the flat of your finger. And make sure that you don't uh, stretch any of the, the pastry and cause tears. So you're lifting and pushing and just working your way all the way around. like so. When that's done you trim off the excess from the edges and it's ready to fill with the filling of your choice. If you'd like to try making a pumpkin pie perhaps I have a link there or maybe you'd like a nice apple and blackberry pie I have a nice recipe there you can try and if you'd like to learn how to line a cake tin I've got a nice little tutorial there for you and of course if you've not already subscribed hit that subscribe button and you'll see regular videos and of course my Minute Monday. Until next time, take care and happy baking. Bye bye.